We need to get everything up. Yeah, 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 yeah. The course was corrected. Let's see. Where was we have no orders now that they've avoided this? Okay. Uh intact blighty cotton. We could Yeah, just do. Just do things. Just do what you want, man. A dimension of suffering? The dimensional portal on Galpen Prime seems to lead to a realm which is opposed to the sapient mind on a fundamental level. Any and all contact with material from this dimension causes intense suffering in the subject, which it continued for more than a few minutes, leads to intense suicidal urges coupled with attempts to mutilate their sensory organs. Even simply studying data recorded in the strange dimension causes intense discomfort in the biological observer and cascading errors in computer systems. Ah, uh, we need to study the portal. Study more. We're about to study, right? And we have bonuses on that. My goodness, we're the researchers and we're, we're hopefully getting our fleets together. More fleets! More and more. Research complete. Auxiliary fire control. Very nice. Uh, yeah. Getting volatile modes going would be a good thing, I think. So let's go for that mode stabilization. We want to do that. I want to stabilize those modes. Oh, the Imperium of Polisi has so much power. Sanak. We built these mining stations, wonderful. And we'll travel to Altair then. Oh, why wait? Uh, stop that, build the mining stations, then travel to Swore instead. And then we'll see where we will expand or not. This is always changing here, it's kind of weird. Anyways. We got the destroyers going. While larger than Corvettes, the destroyer hull configurations still make for comparatively nimble gunboats. Yeah, the question is, can we still go for cruisers? We would have a bonus on that. But it would be wiser, probably, to go for destroyer hulls improved, because then we have better destroyers, even. Mm. The Morphic Stratum, yeah... The holdfast stratum. Uh, look at the fleet management, please. Um, holdfast stratum. Morphic stratum. Are we building anywhere? Scalding stratum. Scalding. Yeah, we should we should bring them all together, right? Um, so all ships assemble, and then we can give them something else. You all travel here, and then we can do see what we can do. Bring it together and make a destroyer force. Elaborate laboratory. Digging deeper. We have uncovered the ship's science lab here. On that asteroid. Minimal power saturates the scene in ultraviolet illumination. A riot of purple shrubberies releasing thick clouds of spores. The ship's doctor used the laboratory and ventilation shafts to flood the ship with an intoxicating mist. It's intriguing. We're, we're getting more and more of that. Regolith Forge corrected. Oh my god. A galactic... Oh, a galactic community? Yeah, we want to join that galactic community. Of course, it's a worthy endeavor. Absolutely. I mean, we're but a small fry so far, but that will change, I hope. And... The Blade of the Huntress. After painstakingly cooming through the valley of Magwell, for any trace of the legendary Huntress, archaeologists were finally able to pinpoint her last resting place. A fossilized skeleton was found locked in battle with the remains of a large horned arthropoid, with a claw still clasping the hilt of a perfectly preserved sword. This must be the blade of the Huntress. The weapon is composed of an unknown material and is sharp enough to cut straight through our strongest armor. Curious! We can activate the relic. Should we do that? 
Sublight speed increase. Activation cost 3000. We don't need that at the moment. But the passive effects are already pretty good. Army morale is plus 25%. Planet sensor range plus 2. And diplomatic weight plus 2. Uh, plus 10%. What? That's really, really cool. The blade of the huntress. That's going to help us militarily. How are you doing? You're overwhelming now. Ooh. Yeah, we've been focusing on expansion, which was probably not the best thing to do, but... Gotta grab that land when it's there, I guess. Gotta grab it here and there. And everywhere. Influence. Mm -hmm. Blockers cleared. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or in secundus. Hmm, the business thing here. Yeah, it's 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 going well. It's going well. We have enough farmers and everything. It's fine. It's all fine. I'm I'm, I'm pretty sure. All that influence. All that influence. All these resources. There's a former bowl corner. Oh, they have cloaked ships already. Throw the switch. Uh, we think we're immune to the full effects of the intoxicating mist. We can get the ship's engines online. We can launch the ship and send it back home for study. This will take time, but the elaborate pharmaceutical laboratory may provide useful biochemical augmentation for our Empire soldiers. Uh, run diagnostics and make repairs. We foolishly thought that we were immune to the mist, but our scientists are experiencing fits of psychotic rage. Fighting has broken out shipwide. We'll need to clear the atmosphere and subdue the mist's victims before we can launch the ship. This delay will cost us time. Subdue the scientists. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is getting crazy. Mm. Putting the research labs online. We have met... Vlor and Vlor seeks Vlor finds. This will interfere with ship systems. And uh, mining. Yeah, we need actually better mining now. So we'll get mining going and we might get mineral purification going. Oh, we don't have that yet. Okay. We need to get going. So this is claiming the starbase. We should claim that starbase here in Swall. Construction complete. Very, very well. Constructed this. It's wonderful enough. You are all connected here. Scalding straight, and we should kind of half these fleets and then see what we can do. The scalding straight, um, yeah. we'll have all of these here and we'll deselect a bit like that fallen straight, um, that morphic straight. Um, uh, we can merge a bit, I guess. This guy with a weathered stratum. Here we go. We have 18, 10. We could have. Yeah, let's transfer ships away from that. And deselect that one thing. And here we can have the scalding stratum. Here we go. So the scalding stratum is already ready. We need to compose something else. The fallen stratum can go away. The scalding stratum can go away. Uh, we have these covert stratums. Now it's a second fleet and we can now compose. Um, what is this thing? Ah, that's the defensive platform can now go for the destroyer. Um, destroyer is at auto best. Ah, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll keep to that for now. For now. Okay. Once we have serious ambitions, we will upgrade all of these, but now 
the morphic stratum needs another ship class and needs destroyers and i think we can just whoop build that stuff yeah we're building quite the number of destroyers it's all good it's all good this is going to be a tech world what 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 i mean we could make it a tech world an active volcano here dust caverns and the portal research area yeah i mean together with the portal research area and the dust caverns that could give us moat harvesting traps that is pretty nice mm, seven amenities yeah we have we need housing though so let's build two times this for housing city districts there's a city district coming let's just build two others and then we can see what we do with these So we're going to be ready soon and we're going to build a lot of research then a lot of research is coming research complete. wonderful mode stabilization exactly what we need we can go basic cloaking fields uh, we should take this opportunity and we now have so many things we can we can start to give out some luxury goods again here on Thea. Basically everywhere. We'll give you those luxury goods. Indulge in that. Indulge, indulge. Yeah, here we go. Here we go. Didn't even cost us too much. We're doing very, very fine with this. The birth of the galactic community, and we are the founding members. A great day for the galaxy. A great day. We have an encounter with the Dalith aliens. Again, the Dalith. Ah, uh, yeah, the Kelsotian Collective. We'll, we'll try. I mean, we'll probably be revealed here soon, but hey. Oh, migration treaties. We get to know many more people. Oh, they want an embassy. They get an embassy. Visceran Confederacy, the Kelson, the Crax Rods. There's so much to see here. And you built that thing here. And you can go now to Altair. Our fleet's ready. Another embassy, ruthless capitalists, mega corps. Oh well. Yeah, you can have your embassy. The Kelzan, the Federation builders. There are actually friendly ones out there, but do they have any kind of power? We will soon find out, I guess. First contact. We've picked up readings of unknown nature. The signals seem to follow some kind of repeating syntax, which could indicate sapient origin. Oh, interesting. We'll see what we'll do. Wonderful. Yeah, they want more. Oh, the Cracks Ross now wants an embassy. The Visarians wants to, an, to have an embassy. The Kelsotians are cordial again, suddenly. Our wrath is a terrible thing to behold. Yeah, I guess so. Consortium of Orobria. Uh, the Mojuska Hookskins are... They're going to be a threat again, I'm pretty sure. What have we found out here? Yeah, we want public trust officers. Enforcers also produce one unity and we can have enhanced surveillance. Oh my goodness, we have an alert, an alert! The Enarian Alliance is coming. They want us to establish mutual embassies too. And look at that, we are getting more influence now from the power projection, probably. 
We'll see what we can do. And we have... Oh, we have met the Artisan Troop. A joyous occasion. Yes, Artisan Troop. That's so great. The Artisan Troop. We have finally met the Artisan Troop. Uh, diplomacy, where are you? Diplomacy. Eh. Uh, contacts, here we go. Uh, the Marauder Clans. The, we whoop. Sorting by relations. We have the artisan troop here. Um, yeah, we wish to become your patron. I think we have much to get. It's a deal. It's a deal. Patron of the arts. And we want to commission an art piece. A filthy rich. Uh, it's a deal. An exhibit art monument that can be enacted on one planet. Following effects, 15% more amenities, 50% more immigration pull. Um, and we want that on the bigger one of the Gaia worlds. So we have the total craze planet here. Mm. An exhibit art monument. Here we go. And then we want another... An, a, a maximum big planet like that Jordan Prime. It's yeah, Thea um, size 19, Jordan is size 17. Thea probably also needs something like this, right? Um, let's see. Hey, um, hello. Artisan troop, give me another art piece. It's a deal. Thea needs that, of course. So, mm. I'm unsure about it, but they don't have like the modifier um, the other worlds have. So others can go to that. So we want that art monument here. And a third one. Yeah, that modifier. I'll show you which modifier I mean. This one, the Lithoid Crater, um, which stops other people from going there. I mean, they have that too, but the Gaia world has enough, has enough habitability value to outbid this, so to say. Let's see about us like to commission another art piece here we go and uh, give me that um did we already have now we can remove it from galpen then let's go to ubo glade uh, yeah we want an art monument here and we want a festival across our world how much will that cost us? It will cost us a bit, but don't care. Tell us more about your troop. Ah, yeah. Several stations inhabited by creatives from many worlds, all unified in the desire to create new beauty. Wonderful. And we've just spent all of our energy credits that we could spend on beauty. And that's just wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. The Covenant. Whew, whew. They want us to get embassies. Everybody likes the powerless. And uh, and I like you too. <laughs> so have a great time until next time. Not to say that you're powerless. Um, we are all, of course, full of power. Have a great time until next time and happy gaming. This is Immanuel Khan signing out. See you soon. Have a great time until then and happy gaming. This is Manuel Khan signing out. See you soon. Have a great time until then. Happy gaming.